Um, so this class is outdoor power. So we try to get the students uh, familiar with small engines, uh, engines for lawnmowers and snowblowers, similar to that. Uh, we meet out here in the auto shop. So Ms. Sherwood's nice enough to let us use the auto shop. Um, we take some of the space up and then we try to put the stuff away. Hopefully we'll get some of the you know, lawnmowers and stuff from people in the neighborhood or some of the students will bring them in so we can take ones that are already, they have you know, something, mixed, or something that's malfunctioning and try to see if all the skills that we've learned we can transfer into a real live you know, machine. At first it was kind of slow and we had to do a bunch of required stuff, so, but uh, once we got in here and we're actually working on stuff, it's not so bad. I think only, we only do one thing in here, we just take stuff apart. Um, hands on, uh, one of those, you know, auto classes stuff. Yeah, I think the more you know about you know, every class that you teach, it just becomes easier, more natural. Um, so this is my second year doing this. Last year, Ms. Sherwood helped me out through most of the semester. Uh, but this year, I have a really good TA, Matthew. Uh, he's taken the class. He really enjoys playing and working on small engines. So, you know, honestly, if he had a teaching certificate, you know, he'd be able to teach the class as well. Um, I think it's always good to take classes that you can to get you ready, because the more ways that you learn how to do something when you're teaching it, you're able to connect with more of the students and help them be able to figure things out as well. Um, in the class, I think my favorite thing about the classes in general is just that you get to see students understanding what's going on. Um, most of them can use the tools and take things apart, even if it's at a different level and put them back together. But to understand when something is broken or how to uh, troubleshoot it and figure out the best way to actually solve that problem. Um, so when we get to the the real live ones, the lawnmowers that are full lawnmowers that are coming from the neighborhood and we're able to fix little problems. It's kind of neat to see the students and myself as well. You know, we, you become proud of actually understanding and being able to fix the problem, um, not just taking stuff apart and putting it back together. How about different parts of the engine? Uh, yes, I feel comfortable working this class. It's really fun. Uh, working on cars, if it's possible. Because uh, I like working on engines, so it's really helpful in the future. I recommend this young because it's a great environment to work in. Uh, according to Mr. Atani, you just pay attention to the stuff. It, it, it's not supposed to be that hard. But I'm not sure yet. I mean, it's not it's not too bad right now, but I mean, it's still pretty early in there. Uh, Possibly, maybe. Um, just interacting with the students. Um, I really enjoy interacting with people, getting to know them, um, and then as much as possible, you know, teaching them how to apply things to the class. Um, I think just that anybody can take a class. You know, if you're interested or you think you might be interested in something related to engines, um, it, it's a class that's here. Um, we have it, you know, every year. Mr. Sherwood is a great teacher, you know, I'm doing my best as well. And it's just a good way to know whether it's a path you want to follow or if it's a path you don't want to follow. Um, taking any class that you do here at, at uh, La Follette is just a good experience so that you can try to narrow down what you're going to do once you graduate. Um, I've always liked to play with engines and, and learn how to take things apart, put stuff together. Uh, so I think it's interesting to me because it's small, it's something you can learn in a short period of time. Um, and you can actually get pretty good at it. Um, a big engine takes a lot longer. Um, so this one, I think it's nice that we have a class for it. A lot of students see small engines. Um, they mow their own lawns. They you know, blow the, the snow on, on their houses. Or some of them have small businesses. So I think it's helpful to have it.